Hey, it's Michael Rosso, Film Photography Podcast. I'm here today in the actually the shipping area, here's our shipping dock, of uh, the filmphotographystore.com. And I received a question today, actually a call from Thomas down in Texas. Hey, Thomas. And he recently purchased a Polaroid 104 automatic land camera from us, and Thomas is having problems loading the camera. So the purpose of this video is to quickly demonstrate how to load film and shoot with your Polaroid 104. So uh, if you've never used one before, very quickly, when you take the cover off, this is what your camera will look like. You'll need to pull out the bellows and you do that by pushing this thumbs up, this arrow up, tab up. That releases the bellows and then you pull them out till you hear it click. You just heard it click. This camera is now ready to shoot and load. I'm loading some Fuji film, FP3000B. This is black and white. You could also use FP100C color film. And this is what will appear when you take it out of the box. Uh, question, of course, is how, what's the proper way to load this into your camera? Well, here's your camera. And on the back of your camera, this compartment is your battery compartment. And here is where you would load your film. Here is a tab. You press that. The back of the camera will open up, and here is the compartment, or tomb as I call it, where you would load your film. When you have a, a, a cartridge, you may be a little confused of how, which way would you load this. Uh, there's only one way to do it, and hopefully by uh, checking this out you'll, you'll, you'll get it right, and that is to take the film, you see here is the cartridge, and here is the film area currently covered by a black protection card. You make sure that this film area is facing the inside of your lens. So there it is. You slip this in here. You snap it in. And then make sure your film tabs, which are here, and this black card are all sitting there nice. And now you will close your camera. You'll hear it click twice. There you go, right here. Okay, and now your camera is properly loaded. Uh, it's very important at this time to uh, uh, first pull your first tab out, which is your black protection tab. This is a difficult part if you've never used this camera before because sometimes it does rip. So you have to pull it with your uh, uh, index finger and thumb, grab it, and then slowly rock it. And, whoop, oh, tab broke. And this is a great example of uh, a problem that will occur in these types of cameras. It's not the end of the world. Don't panic. Open your camera up. Put this over here. Open your camera up, and here is your black tab. And you could slowly inch it out a little bit. Close your camera back up so you can get another grip on your black tab. As you can see, there it goes. Now you're ready to take your first picture and there is one tab sticking out of your camera. It says one, that is your first image. I'm going to take a picture of our camera person, Justin, today. As he shoots me, I'm going to focus up and then one, two, three. Okay. I just took my first picture. Uh, by cocking the shutter and then pressing the red uh, shutter button to take my picture. Once you do that, you're ready to pull out your first picture, which is a two-step process. Uh, first you grasp the number one tab and then gently rock it. Sometimes I brace it against my chest. I'll gently rock it and pull it out. There it is. And then when doing that, a second tab will appear, which is your actual photograph. Uh, grab this gently and firmly and consistently pull it out until the picture is out of the camera. Here we go. And that is our first picture. And hopefully we have successfully taken a photograph. Let's take a look. You have to wait about 30 seconds because uh, FP3000B is super speedy and will develop very quickly. So you can whistle or, I don't know, think of a joke or...
Or if you have a friend, you can talk to your friend. You can talk to Justin. Hey, Justin. Hey, how you doing? Good. Hey, I'm waiting for this uh, picture to develop. Oh, really? That, yeah. must, that must be a, uh, a, a very tedious uh, thing to do. It is. Now, the first time you do this process, I will admit, because I, it happened to me, it is very scary. You don't know what you're doing, you're a little confused, you don't feel confident, and the only way to do it is by doing it. Now, it's, it's conceivable you may sacrifice a pack of film. That It happens, and it's happened to me, and you just need to kind of forge through and move forward and not worry, and just, and just move forward, because once you get the knack of it, you'll get years worth of joy from using this camera. Here's our first image. We're going to peel it. And there he is, Justin. Hmm. I want to thank you very much. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, you could email me at podcast at filmphotographyproject.com or visit the website filmphotographyproject.com. We also carry this camera in our store. Click on the store tab. Thank you very much, and I'll see you soon.